The Queen. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Introducing first, from the Queen City, Charlotte Flair. Corey, many people believe Charlotte may be the best pure athlete the women's division has ever Seen. It's hard to argue that statement. Charlotte Flair has backed up every claim she has made since arriving in WWE. Listen, it was Charlotte who only took a couple months after her debut to win her first championship here in WWE, and Charlotte hasn't looked back since. The ever impressive Dana Brooke. And from Cleveland, Ohio, Dana Brooke. Saxon, put your action figures away. Playtime is over. Bodybuilder strength, acrobatic athleticism. Dana Brooke has all of the skills to dominate the women's division. There's no doubt she has beauty, there's no doubt she has power, but she also has brains. Did you guys know that Dana Brooke has never lost a match on the same day that Byron Saxton had a date? Really? That's right. Amazing Byron, stat. when was your last date? None of your business. Exactly. to nobody that she didn't want to. Paige is truly a revolutionary in WWE. Yeah! Guys, remember on Raw a few years ago when Paige made her WWE debut and won the Women's Championship. A truly unforgettable night, not only for Paige, but the entire WWE Universe. Paige has revolutionized the game since that very night. And it was that night where we began the transformation from the Divas Revolution to the Women's Evolution. This huge three on three matchup. Then there's the Bella powerhouse herself, Nikki Bella. And what's there to say about Nikki that hasn't already been said? Her list of accomplishments in WWE speaks for itself. Oh, you're right. There's probably not a more formidable opponent in this women's division than Nikki Bella. Simply based on all she's done, she's an intimidating force in the women's division. Situations like this usually don't end very pleasantly. 
Up and face first. Slapjack. Now trampling the opposition. Nikki Bella with a nice reversal. Yet another counter. It's like they're both somehow one step ahead of each other. Oh my goodness, crushing it. Gets the tag. And she's back in the ring now. In control here with us. Looking stunned. Looking rocked. Oh. Kick right to the midsection. Just ruthless. And it's Dana Brooke with the offense. Oh, close line. Wow, incredible height. Knife edge chop. Reed Bella makes the tag. Six-man tag team matches have been a staple of competition since the early days of sports entertainment. Two teams of three compete against one another under traditional tag team rules. Stipulations can be added like no disqualification, two out of three falls, elimination, falls count anywhere, or whatever else someone could think of. Matches can also be held in a caged environment. Just carrying the opposition here. In control here with a swinging neck breaker. Textbook. Six-man tags can be fought under so many different types of stipulations. Teams can be part of a faction. The three superstars of the line because of a common interest. The most crucial aspect to a six-man tag team being successful is that trio's ability to act as one cohesive unit. Three individuals working collectively at all times. So much can take place during a six-man tag match. Regardless of what type of match the teams of three are competing in, the members of that team must be on the same page. Oftentimes, the teams who have the best continuity are the most successful. Tagged in. Wow. There's a crucifix. Nicely done. Desperately trying to get to the corner now. It's not going to be easy, though, Michael. She's so close to making the tag. And if she doesn't, I don't see how they can win this thing. That's how important this tag is right now. Able to get the tag. Face crusher. Six of WWE's most alpha personalities all competing in the same match. There's a good chance this one ends deteriorating sooner than later. Oh man, what a leg drop! Hey, man, oh my god, what a forearm! Right to the jaw. Up and around, down with a tilt the world backbreaker. Foxy's going crazy. Yeah, she's a little bundle of energy right now. Brie Bella gets the tag. Axe handle finds its target. Oh my, down with authority. There it is. Boom, nice. Struggling to get to the corner here. Might not make it, Michael. on the attack now. Now rearrange the spine. There it comes. Well, that'll do some serious damage. Needs to make it to the corner here, Corey. Oh, you're absolutely right, Cole. There's no way around it. A tag is vital at this point in the match. Oh, the reversal by Bree Bella. Forward to the face. Oh, nothing fancy about that. In off the tag. Back in the ring now. Kick to the gut. 
Here's the setup. Looking to make a much needed tag here. And if successful, we may be looking at a whole new match here. Looks like we're going to get the tag. I think you're right, Michael. She makes it to her corner. And not a moment too soon. Alicia Fox creating her opportunity here. She's got her. Look at this. Caught off guard. Suplex. Hoping to make a tag here. And it sounds like there are a lot of people here tonight hoping for the exact same thing. Looks like she's gonna make it, Corey. Yeah, but looks like he's deceiving Cole, you know that. All Paige is going for it early. One, two, she three. kicks out of that one. Gonna take more than that. Uh-oh. Reed Bella makes the tag. Oh, she's not looking good here. The first thing she needs to do is somehow get out of that corner. Wait a minute. Trouble up on the top rope. Oh! Charm drag. And Paige manages to reverse out of that. some of the action from the previous match. Remember this? She's taking care of business. Victory. I knew she was going to win the whole time, Michael. What an effort we saw here. Truly a great match.